Hello, this is Samadan, and Samadan is on a journey not to die. So here we are at the auction house in Stormwind. We've been doing a little bit of buying of linen cloth off stream, and we have managed to get ourselves, what have we got at the moment, 40 silver, and still level 12. Got the whole level to go through before we get to level 13. So let's collect up our mail first, because hopefully we should have some sales. It's been a while, so let's go have a look. So the main thing we've been doing is buying any cheap linen cloth under 25 copper, converting it to brown linen robes, disenchanting those, and selling the enchanting mats. And so we've got, oh, we've actually got over a gold, one gold 15, some that expired. But that's really good. So we now have one gold 56. That's fantastic. So the usual proce procedure has been to just see if we can find any cheap ones. Let's go have a look, see if we've got any at the moment. The sniper has been kind of working on and off. It's not something I'd really want to rely on. Usually a quick shopping search every now and again works out in my favour. So we've got some for under 23 at the moment. Let's see what else we have. Let's just scale this down a little bit actually. Okay, that's a bit better. So we're at 23, then up 25, and then there's a whole load beyond that. So it's, it's minimal um, profit margins at this point. So I'm just gonna leave that as it is for the moment. If we actually just pop on our strange dust that we do have, maybe we can sell that for one silver 16 seems a good price. One silver 23 is my average anyway. So I'll just wait for that scan to finish. We'll put those on. I'm thinking today we could probably do a little bit more questing. Worth it to uh, get out in the world and do a few things. Because that's one of the alternatives really to buying all this linen cloth is it's quite feasible to go out there and, and kill things and, and get the linen cloth and the other items that way. But it's quite fun to sit in the auction house because it's safe and safe means there's no real risk of dying. Um, and with hardcore that's that's a big consideration. So we are currently have installed Questy just to try and keep a, a better track of my quests and everything. So we've got Princess Must Die has been done We've got a couple of garrisons here, so not much in the way of quests. If we bring this on, we have some extra quests coming up. I've kind of used this just so that I don't miss out on quests, that's the main thing. Um, so I can see where to go for all my quests. It kind of does uh, ruin the immersion a little bit, but I think it's quite easy to see that uh, this area down in Westfall is probably the next thing we need to do. So let's go and head on down there. In terms of equipment and things, I mean, we could buy some things. It probably might be even worth buying ourselves a greater magic wand, but I'm going to make one up myself. That should be easy enough to do once we've got ourselves up to that level and got a little bit more gold. Let's start with just buffing ourselves up. Ready? We've still got two hours left on the world buff, which is really nice. out into the world and see what what dangers lie within Be safe human warrior bye bye buffs are always always the best so uh, we are let's head out of here first um, we're heading down to hand in the necklace first because that's an outstanding quest for now. Let's cut through here. There's going to be some defias around here anyway, but I think that should be within our capabilities now. Just keep using tab just to keep on keep an eye on my bearings. So 
There's one last. Nice. You're level six, so that should be a really easy. They've gone. They've gone grey to me now, so I won't get any XP for them. There is a chance of linen cloth and a little bit of copper. Six copper, in fact. There's the graveyard. Don't plan on visiting that anytime soon. Yeah, these are all fairly trivial. Not not to get complacent, of course. But some extra things along the way. There's a quest over here as well, so I think I'll do that. Pick that one up whilst we're here. The good thing about having quest is it does give you the level of the quest, which gives me an indication as to how difficult it might be. That way I can be a little bit safer. So what have you got inside? Let's have a look. Here you are, gentleman blacksmith. What can, I'm sorry, I'm a bit busy right now making horseshoes for Werner Osgood in Lakeshire. Okay, what's Elmore's task? There's a dwarven weaponsmith in Stormwind, Grimmond Elmore, who sent word that he needs help with a delivery. I believe he wants a package sent to his homeland in the north. You have a sturdy pair on you, so if you're interested in some legwork, then speak with Grimmond. We could use you down here, but we must also keep our ties strong with the dwarves. You can find Grimmond Elmore at the weapon shop in the dwarven district of Stormwind in the northeast section of town. Now that's interesting. Some seed quests to take me over to the dwarven side of things. I did consider this as an option, is actually going over to like Loch Modan and doing the quests over there. It will help with my faction, um, it's great for the storyline, and it will give me some XP with the quests. So I may take you up on that one. Be careful. We'll see how we get on with the rest of Elwyn though, because I think we're almost done here. Let's go hand in the necklace, which is around this direction. Oh, look, someone on a mount. A level 56 no mage. Wow, that's fantastic. One day soon, I'm sure. I will need to clear these out as I go. Anything for a little bit of extra, extra loot. Bag space wise, we're pretty good. So I'm, I'm okay with that. We've got gnolls and things to deal with over here. We also have the dreaded hogger at some point in the future. That's something I'll uh, I may need to group up with again like we did with Princess. That was fun doing that. It's nice to have people around to help out with quests like that. Oops, not quite close enough. We've got our um, inner fire on actually, should really have that on. The extra armour is actually huge, 315. But Elmore's task, you can see he's red, so that's more of a level 15 thing according to Questy. Or is this is more of a level 9 thing. Hey there. Did you see her? Did you get her? We did indeed. Thank goodness. That pig was getting so big she'd have eaten our whole crop. Thank you, adventurer. Now, do either of these suit you? Now, let's see. Farmer's boots. I've actually got better boots on at the moment. So I'll go with mail because it'll probably actually no the uh, the weather weather worn ones vendor for most compared to those. So we'll take those. Have a good one. Thank you very much. Okay, next up is to head over to the garrison here. We've got wanted hogger eleven plus. So let's ho head over this direction.
let's go back up towards the road because I think there's knolls around here that we should probably be a bit careful of. There's one just over the other side. I don't know what kind of level they are though, so let's just check them out. They're eight. Okay, that's not too bad. As well get ourselves a little bit of XP for a green mob. Oh, and they run as well. They run fast. That's something to bear in mind. Uh, there's a garrison over in the corner. Let's go have a look. And some guards. And Forest's Edge. That's now discovered. So we just need to do this area down here where we've explored everything. So that was a little quest here. Wanted Hogger. <laughs> the dangers of Hogger. I love the actual uh, pictures we have here. It's fantastic. Wanted Hogger, a huge knoll hogger prowling the woods in southwestern Elwyn. He has overpowered all attempts at his capture. The Stormwind Army has placed a generous bounty on the knoll. To earn the reward, bounty hunters should bring proof of Hogger's demise to Marshal Dugan in Goldshare. Slay the knoll hogger and bring his huge knoll claw to Marshal Dugan. And we get... Well, the thing that would be useful to us is the staff. We haven't learned how to use staffs yet. So we'll, uh, we'll accept it anyway. That will be something uh, we might need to group up for to deal with Hogger. And then here, there's the wanted poster again. Greeting. I can't believe the officials in Stormwind sending the bulk of our army abroad when our home front is under so much pressure. With thieves coming from Westfall and knolls encroaching from, from the east and west, it's a wonder Stormwind itself isn't besieged. It's a wonder indeed, but thankfully we are here to help out. Marshal Dugan sent you, eh? Well, you're not from the army, but if Dugan sent you, then that's good enough for me. Our situation is, to say the least, a stressed one. I hope you can give us a hand. I'll do my best. What have you got? Knolls, brutish creatures with no decent business in these lands, have been seen along the borders of Elwyn Forest. A large pack of them, many more than we can handle alone, have infested the woods south of the guard tower yonder. yonder. Another group has infested the areas near Stone Cairn Lake to the east. Oh, we found and those. The army will commend whomever helps kill them. Bring me their painted knoll armbands as proof of your deed. Okay, so we've dealt with those ones, and uh, so we can do we can do this, and that's a good upgrade to our legs. So, yes, please. Now, was there something inside as well? And now I have this um, from Questy, which helps me, but I kind of don't want that kind of um, that kind of help, really. Um, that's probably a way I can turn that off. Let's have a look. Um, available quest objective. I'm going to turn that off. Available quests I definitely want. Mailbox I definitely want. Trivial quests. I might want to do those. So I'm going to turn that on. And profession trainers. I think I'll leave all that to just exploration at this point. Just want the minimal, really. So what does that give me? There we go, that looks a little bit better. Let's show Questy, so I can just see the quests. That's that's much more my preferred way anyway. Okay, so Knowles it is. Let's go have a look. Let's have a look what's to the south. There's Westfall over there. I don't think we're quite ready for Westfall. That's kind of 10, 12, 14, 12 and 15. Only just 12. What have we got? Long Snout. Is that a particular boar? Level 10. Number 69, deadliest. Let's try it. Don't 
Doesn't mar isn't marked as named or anything like that, or elite. It is level 10. There we go. Thank you, Long Snout. Well, I can't see that well here, so I'm going to zoom out a little bit. There's definitely... There's another Long Snout. Maybe it's not an elite. Maybe it's just a type of... Type of... Uh, so these are nine. Type of boar. Okay, we're going to watch out for runners. That's the other thing to think about here. Let's zoom out a little bit more. There's a bear. Okay, linen cloth is always good. Ooh. <laughs> Spawning right on top of me. Okay. I was able to interrupt that. Take things a little more carefully. That's going to be the case. I could possibly take two on at once, but I would rather not if I can. There's some good linen cloth from these, though. That is nice to see. These are right by the tower as well, so it is a dangerous area. There's a pack of those as well, it looks like. Yeah, long snout is just the type of bear. The type of ball, it would seem. Resist. Okay. Try another one. There's a load over here. Gotta watch out for. It did seem like a, a named bear. No, a named ball. Bears and balls. Getting those mixed up. Want to keep things clear. Now I'll get the outliers like this one, I think. The thing to watch out for is them running that direction though. There goes two people. They seem to be doing alright. I'm gonna stick to the edges. Not in the river. That would be bad. Just check the camps. There's obviously a few have been killed here, so watch out for respawns. There we go. Uh oh. <laughs> That's a unit scan. That's the first time I've ever seen it. Okay. <laughs> that scared me. So that's what uh, unit scan hardcore does. It warns me of elites nearby, which in this case, uh, I'm very pleased about. I'm just going to take this very carefully. we will seem to be running around a lot. I'm going to go over this other edge, avoiding the camps. And just get the outliers, I think I'll be safer. They come in packs of three, it looks like. Unless there are single ones like that, trolling around. Which I can at least pick off. The only thing is, is running. Running into the camp is bad. There's an armband. That's the first of eight. a single one. Where are you headed? There's a corpse of someone there. There's another one over there. Wait for that to come in. There we go. Work on the edges. That's all 60s coming through. good thing is with my Shadow Word Pain, if they do run, at least that helps. There's Hogger. Just going to ignore that for now. Yeah, 
are you doing, my hunter friend? Got Hogger, level 11. Don't want to uh, get myself into trouble here. I'll make sure you're okay. Yeah, you're level 12. So you should be okay, I think, with Hogger. Doing well so far. Cat's doing okay. You got it, well done. Let me just uh, avoid that area for now. Go around the back, around the edges. Just in case. I think I should be away from Hogger. Hogger's in the middle somewhere as far as I remember. If I want to do a little bit safer perhaps, I could go round. Things things of danger over that over that shore and over that shore. So I really have to be careful here. There's another camp with a chest. That will be bait though, I'm not going for that. Just stick to the edges. Okay, this one. Okay, back around the edges. Okay, lots of people in here, we'll just ignore those for now. I'm staying well out of danger here. Obviously, of course, I could group up and that would make things easier. But I often find I don't really know how long I'm going to be playing for, so I don't tend to like to commit to groups, if I can at all help it. So I'll, I'll stick with the solo play as much as possible. One we could probably take though. I'm gonna be close. I'm not sure how annoying that beeping going off is though, so uh, do let me know in the comments or anything. You want me to turn it off? Kind of giving me mild palpitations at the moment. There's Hogger over there. Just going to stick with the knolls on the edges. Like these. We're doing quests wise, we're about a third of a level way through, just through killing these. Seems to be a good thing to grind on at the moment. Let's do, let's get the order of this right. Do the bear first. Then we'll do this one to the left and then the one to the right. Lovely seeing all the griffins flying down the flight path here. And then this one we can do. Oh, we've already got it. How are we doing with the packs? I know people have been breaking them up a little bit. See, there's three there. Which is three too many, really. Ooh, we've sold our strange dust. Fantastic. This is the single one we want to pull out. 
wait for you to come a bit closer. And we'll put you in. Should be fine. Man is doing okay at the moment. Keeping keeping our wits about us. Not much in the armbands dropping though. Just playing it safe. Quite a few resists there. I'm getting some good stuff we could sell here. Vendors for 87 copper. And we're getting some good linen cloth as well. Just gonna stick to the edges. if I can just do it with a dot and a wand and a shield. Oh, our uh, armor's dropped actually. Forget that. Could probably do with a weak aura or something to remind me of that. You out, my friend, with a buff? I guess it would make sense to carry on killing the long snouts as well. Stay clear for now. It's the camps that scare me. I mean, you're right in the middle there. That's, that's brave. Brave to be there. Gonna stick to the edges. Like that. And I can pull them back away and then finish them off at a distance. Far away from the camp. Ooh, Malachite. A bit of copper ore there as well. Only I had mining as well. It's going to pop up at some point, I'm sure. Is that an outrunner? Okay, here. Just means someone's been here recently. There's Hogger. Looks like these have been dealt with recently. The periphery ones, so... There's a few here, what have you got? That's an outrunner, there's one over here. Just avoid those, if I can pull this one down to the side. And finish that one off, okay. In order to have less competition, I'd be better off going off to the east. I've got nothing really sending me in that direction at the moment. So doing circuits around here is probably going to be my best bet. If I'm feeling brave, I could try on a pack of three. I'd have to be exceptionally brave to be able to do that. I'm not fully sure it's advisable. I mean, these long snouts are good XP, so we might as well as we're doing the circuit, because the time at the moment is lost in in running. So many level 60s.
guess the other thing I could do is if I see someone help them out. Like that, just clear that out for them. Oh, oh, there's loads. Okay. I'm going to take this one. I'm going to move it over here with me. Yep, they're all coming towards me. I'm going to run. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's not good. What if the guards will help here? Where is everyone? Okay, there's a few. Let's help out with this one. Just make sure everyone's okay. There we go. <laughs> okay. There's a lot in one go. Okay, at least one's dead, so there we go, we'll take that. Who's this over here? Frankson, a human rogue. That's the danger of helping out as well, really. Is you never know what else has been tagged. And the aggro then falls onto you. It's off. Where are you off to, Frankson? Where are you headed, Frank? Frank Abignale, Jr. If you get the reference, let's grab this one. It's lovely, the griffin just flying straight past. In the middle of combat. around. Distinct lack of armbands though. I mean, I'd probably have to clear the camps. That one on its own. Yes, probably. And some resists though. Always dangerous. How are we doing for everything? We have armbands oh, three of eight, and a, quite a few bits, bits and pieces. Thinking I probably be safer to finish off here rather than do another circuit. Let's just clear our way out, and we'll probably just end up over here to finish off, and then we'll probably have to come back and do this again on another session. thinking of a safe, now ideally, probably, Hearthstone back. Don't know how safe these will be as places. I'm guessing here could be safe enough. There's a couple of guards either side. The tower, surrounded by guards. I think that's probably as safe as I'm going to get. Hopefully. Let's log off here. I think I think we should be good for now. We've got a little bit more space, so we'll come back to this and do another session. And then probably head back to Stormwind. But then one gold fifty-eight. I think what I can do in terms of professions wise as well. Tailoring's at ninety out of hundred and fifty. Enchanting slow slowly lagging behind for lesser magic one, make a few more of those. Um so with our linen cloth, we've got 14 of that and 4 bolts, so we could make some brown linen robes and then turn that into enchanting materials. And rather than selling the Lesser Magic Essence, we then make Lesser Magic Wands to skill up. Uh, we've got the two enchant braces as well, actually. We can do that as well, so there's, there's options here. Uh, might as well uh, at least enchant one of my braces with minor health whilst we're at it. Okay, so we've got options. Lots of things to do. Um, but that was a good little XP run. We got half a level there. So halfway through level 12. Then we've got the greater magic wand to get hold of. And then I might feel a little bit more comfortable. Comfortable. 
um, taking on those packs of three uh, once I've got my wand. So that will be the, the next the next focus next time. So until next time, stay safe, enjoy your journey. See you soon. Goodbye for now.